Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to my Mass Effect Legendary Edition Renegade playthrough. It's your man, Positively Glad, bringing you live coverage of episode number eight. In the previous episode, we rescued Dr. Liara Tassoni, and we are now going back to the galaxy map to head back to the Citadel for a walk around, just to make sure that no other missions have kind of popped up, which I believe they do after you do this. Forgive me, guys, I've Bit of a bad chest there tonight. So you have to bear with me. Oh, man. Jesus. Lots of food. <laughs> so right, we're gonna travel to the system here. And away we go. Back to the city now. Even evil people suffer from hay fever, guys. <laughs> Message coming in. Oh it through. Commander okay. Shepard, my name is Nasana Dantius. I have a job for you. I can't say anymore in an unsecured communication. If you're interested in hearing my offer, meet me on the Citadel so we can talk in person. I'll be waiting in the Diplomat's Lounge on the Presidium. Ah, okay. So there is something definitely more to do. Set off the first time in the game. I'm gonna get my inhalers in a minute, guys, just to make sure. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Ah, okay. This little idiot. Seeing the ward stretching out before you really makes you appreciate the Citadel. As a true wonder of Prothean engineering. A private docking bay. Wonder how much the Alliance had to shell out for this. Couple of pennies, man. Oh, here we go. This guy is awesome. But we have to be evil. Right, guys, give me two seconds. Just get my inhaler. Sorry, I'm going to leave my mic on. Right, that's a bit better. Okay, here we go. Holy, I was got 30. Oh my fucking holy moly! All right, okay, we're gonna go. Advanced throw, advanced lift, and advanced. Advanced barrier. Here we go. Brilliant. Okay, anyone else? Oh, Rex is off some points, so we'll, um. Heavy armor. And anyone else? Throw. Work towards stasis. Shepard have any more renegade I could do? Not at the moment, okay. 
Rear Admiral Mihailovic, 5th Fleet. Admiral, I'm on urgent business with the Citadel. Is there something you need? Let's get one thing clear, Shepard. You might be a specter to the aliens, but to me, you're just a <laughs> officer. Be respectful. I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. And the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. I wasn't keen on it either, but there are advantages to being above the law. Don't let the title go to your head. No one's above the law. I don't begrudge oh, the are. politician's decision to throw you to the council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. This ship saved our lives a dozen times over. An exaggeration. I've read your reports. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills for the same price we could have had a heavy cruiser. But no, we had to make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. Normandy is an Alliance warship, but she's on loan to the Citadel. That means she's not in your chain of command. I believe there's something oh, wrong with my ears. Did you just contradict me? This ship oh, is council property right now. So, respectfully, please clear the gangway. Have it your way, Commander. <laughs> but expect me to file a report on this. <laughs> Nailed. Get out of there. <laughs> In breaking oh, mate, news, love it. Chairman Burns of the Parliament Subcommittee on Transhuman Studies has been kidnapped by biotic extremists. Oh, boy. The biotics commandeered a freighter and were last seen in the Hades Gamma Cluster. No demands have yet been made. Oh, we gonna fuck you up. <laughs> we gonna fuck you up. Seriously. Oh, man, you're getting it. Yeah, they're all getting it. So I guess if I do sound a bit flat tonight, I'm literally, um... I'm on a um, hay fever moment at the moment, so I feel sorry for myself. Just um. Commander Shepard. Oh no. Oh, what your mind. What have you seen in Westernland news? Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? I'm not in the mood, Miss Algelani. People back home have heard a lot of wild stories about you, Commander. <laughs> I think you have a chance to set the record straight. What do you say? I don't have time to justify myself to your viewers. I have a galaxy to save. Excuse me. Your choice, Shepard. Oh, what? Oh, not did it again. Fuck's sake. Right, I'm gonna actually reload that. Fuck that up, man. Seriously. I keep fucking missions up, dude. I get through this Koku shit again. Make sure I see where we are. Go ahead. Right, okay. Ah! Fucking chest is hitting, man. Seriously. I gotta do these skills again? Damn it. Fuck. Okay, uh. There you go, we're buzzing, right, okay, Rex is gonna get a uh, Krogan Navy armor, and I wanna get a uh, extra one on to throw will do. Yeah, put on to throw, there you go. Oh, barrier, barrier, barrier. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Can't believe I fucked that up, bro. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Rear Admiral Mihailovic, 5th Fleet. Admiral. Let's I'm get on one thing. I command the. And the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles. I wasn't whatever. keen on it either. Don't let the type. 
I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw this you. ship saved our lives. An exaggeration. This? But no. We had... I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I believe there's something wrong with my ears. Did you just... This ship me? is canceled, probably. Have it your way, Commander. You are unlike the other Krogan I have met, Rex. You do not share the bloodlust of your people. When you're young... Oh, I fucked up. I went to have the interview with Khalees Al Jelani. I just turned around and told the fuck off. <laughs> like she didn't even get an interview from her. Will find you. <laughs> Amen to that, my Rex. You'll see, bitch. Commander Shepard? Khalees had been seen oh, in Al Jelani, Westernland News. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? I'm not in the mood, Miss Algelani. People back home have heard a lot. I can give you the chance to set the record straight. What do you say? What do you want to know? You've been given a unique position to represent our race. People want to get a sense of how you'll do that. <laughs> Humans have been trying to oh, get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human Spectre? We all know it should have happened years ago. Oh, was it? I hope the council it. realizes that we won't sit at the kids' table forever. Some believe that without firm action on our part, the council will continue to treat us like poor relations. Have you encountered any situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? I think they know not to ask me to work against my own people. I think our viewers will be glad to hear that, Commander. You've been given oh, command of an advanced human warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? I've had enough of your snide insinuations. What? What's he doing? What are you doing? <laughs> you son of a bitch! Punch you in the face! I'll make sure everyone in the Alliance sees that. Your career is over. Smack the... I thought he was going to tell the fuck off. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, you've become my hero, son. <laughs> it's a bit harsh. It's a bit fucking harsh, man. Ah, uh, I don't think there's anything Has he got anything to say, Shalik? Good to see you, Commander. Nah, nothing. It's never, there's nothing up there, I know that for a fact. Um, <laughs> my chest hurt, man, because of the art sneezing I've done today, but, um, yeah, so if I do sound a bit flat, you have to forgive me. Right, so we'll go to the Presidium. In breaking news, Chairman <coughs> Burns of the Parliament Subcommittee on Transhuman Studies has been kidnapped by Biotic... <coughs> the Biotics commandeered a freighter and were last seen in the Hades Gamma Cluster. No demands have yet been made. I think this will just be, it might just be a Citadel runaround mission stream, maybe, I don't know. Wait till I'm feeling a bit better to do the, um... Right, um, we're gonna go this way. We'll start off, uh, up top. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. I think there's, yeah, Nasana's over here. Ah, oh, you want to speak to me now, do you? Commander Shepard, I am Nasana Dantius. I see you got my message. You said you had a job offer. I do. My sister Dahlia is a crewman on a cargo vessel operating out beyond the fringes of the Traverse. Her ship was attacked by privateers. There were no reported survivors. You want me to hunt down the people who killed her? This is where it gets complicated. <clears throat> Last week, I received a message with her voice on it. Dahlia is alive. The rest of the crew was killed, but she was taken prisoner. The slavers demanded a huge ransom from me in exchange for returning her unharmed. Why didn't the raiders kill Dahlia along with everyone else? My sister probably told them who she was. Her family's very wealthy, Shepard. They must have realized oh, she was worth more oh, than alive. 
You can't negotiate with criminals. It's too late. I transferred the funds to the account they oh, specified. Oh, stupid bitch, Only man. they never released her. They haven't contacted me since. I've made a terrible mistake, Shepard. I'm a diplomatic <coughs> emissary. By law, I'm required to report any attempted extortion to CSEC immediately. But I was afraid for Dahlia, so I just paid the ransom. Now she's still missing. And if anyone finds out what I did, I could end up in jail. Why would they put you in jail? You're the victim here. Government representatives on the Citadel are not allowed to negotiate with terrorists. It's too dangerous. Paying a ransom would only encourage more kidnappings. I support the law Very in true. theory, but when I got the message, all I could think about was Dahlia's safety. I doubt they would actually send me to prison for what I did, but they would strip me of the post, <laughs> And Dahlia would still be in the hands of the slavers. You got in over your head and you expect me to pull you out? This is easy money for you, Shepard. I've already found her. You just need to bring her back. I tracked the ransom payment through several accounts. Eventually, oh, they went okay. through a small mercenary band operating out of the Artemis Tau Cluster. I need you to go to the Merc base, take them out, and bring my sister back. You shall be well rewarded. Anything you can tell me about the Mercs who have your sister? Pretty much what you'd expect. Rough, dangerous, and well-armed. Nothing a Spectre cannot handle, though. Can't you hire someone else to do this? I do not want to take chances with my sister's life. I need a Spectre. Besides, Touché. you operate outside official channels. My superiors cannot find out I never reported the ransom in the first place. How'd you find out who was behind the ransom? I have resources. Contacts and credits can go a long way. I <laughs> don't be willing to bend the rules. I already broke the law when I paid the ransom. This couldn't make things any worse. Not don't worry. Forget. I'll bring your sister back. Thank you, Shepard. I knew you were the right man for the job. Oh, God. Come back and see Let me when the job is done. Ugh, no renegade. Poor bastards. Strange. Wish there were more humans around. Racist! There's actually nothing up here, I don't think. Allow me to be your guide. She never lives, does she? Fucking bitch. Oh, where's the wards? Over here, isn't it, I think? We're gonna go for the wards. Chorus then, flux. Green, you're right. So tell me, who'd win in a fight between you and Shepard? Do Krogan size up everyone for a fight? Even friends and allies? Yes. Uh -huh. Oh! <laughs> Cheers for letting us know, brother. Yeah. Oh. Cool. I never come here, so there could be well, loads of random but... Sounds good. Some of the others are going for Novio's farewell thing. Damn, I forgot that was today. Where's he going again? Novaria. Apparently, they've got a huge demand for corporate security. Novaria? Isn't that the frozen planet? Yeah. Huh. I wouldn't go, but I guess the pay's pretty good. Huh. Okay. Will we see him? You never know. <sighs> what's in that? What's down here? Oh, a keeper. Yeah. There's actually about 23 keepers saying that. In remembrance of Eden Prime, we present another profile in courage with serviceman Nirali Bhatia. Wife and talented chef, serviceman Batia joined the Alliance military under the Deferred Education Plan. After finishing her service, Batia planned to open a restaurant. Instead, she gave her life protecting the colonists of Eden Prime. 
For more profiles in Courage or to explore opportunities in the military, please visit the Alliance Military on the Extranet. Keyword Courage. Keyword Twat. any more missions here. I fucked up the Emily Wong mission as well. I'm gutted, man. I need those supplies for my clinic. I can't. You can and you will. Hello. Or your story won't be <laughs> secret. Don't disappoint me, <laughs> Doctor. Oh, oh boy. Shepard, I didn't see you come in. Every time I come in here, I see someone threatening you. Who is that? <laughs> someone from my past. I can take care of it. Just tell me what's going on. I was fired by my previous employer for giving out free medical supplies to clinics like this. They never filed any charges. They just wanted me to leave without any fuss. But somebody must have found out. Now they are blackmailing me. I have to give them what they want. If the board finds out about my past, I could lose my license. They'll shut my clinic down. Maybe I can get you out of this. Tell me what they want. I have to give some of my medical supplies to a merchant in the markets. They expect delivery Give me your contact's name. Deal with him. But won't they expose my past? They won't bother you again. I guarantee it. <laughs> see. Maybe it's better if I don't know anymore. I was told to speak with a merchant named Morlan down in the market. Oh boy. I really appreciate this, Commander. Thank don't you. worry. I'll take care of it. Good luck, Commander. Be careful. <laughs> oh, you're fucking old dead, mate. Oh boy. I was just oh yeah, about to say this your stream interesting, was it? Bad isn't it? Oh fuck. I was gonna be doing proper side missions, but I thought I'd have a little track around the set all tonight, have a quick stream. <coughs> I think it's the breathing is pretty shit. So it's not that, it's just I've sneezed that much from low on oxygen right now. <gasps> Conrad! You were too busy to talk last time, but that's not a problem. I know you're busy being the first human specter and all. I don't have time for this crap. Go back oh, shit. to the hole you crawled out of. So that's how it is. the rest of us should just let you reap the fame and glory? Well, you're not the only one who can stand up for humanity. I'll show you. Oh, boy. Ah. <laughs> uh. Right, that was... Go back to whatever hole you came out of. <laughs> Hello there, welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? You were expecting a delivery of medical supplies? But I was told the doctor would be bringing them. Change of plans. A change, but... The doctor... I don't... This is not right, human. Shut up, Morlan. I told Baines you'd screw this up. What the hell's going on here? Who are you? Leave the doctor alone. Or you'll have to deal with me. We can end this if you just bring me those supplies. Otherwise, I'll start telling people about the doctor's little secret. Her secret stays buried. Or I bury you. Hey, hold on! I'm just the middleman here. This is way more than <laughs> he I shits himself. For. Thank you, human. It is good to see him humbled so. What do you know about Bane? I <laughs> oh, have met a human. 
I only worked with the one who spoke with the doctor. Goodbye. Yes, all right then. Good tidings to you, human. Renegade! Oh, Renegade! <laughs> the med clinic I guess like I said I don't expect to speak as much as what I usually have been doing just um on QT now just um using up the oxygen as and when I can Commander how did things go he won't be bothering you anymore Really? <laughs> That's a great relief, Commander. Thank you. I can't pay you for your help, but I can give you a discount on any supplies you purchase here. The thug said he worked for a man named Baines. Sound familiar? Baines? I wonder if he means Armiston Baines. We worked together a long time ago. What can you tell me about him? Last I heard, the Alliance military was contracting him for some research in the Traverse. Perhaps Captain okay. Anderson will have some knowledge. We'll see what the Captain can tell us. I wish I could tell you. Is there anything else I can help you with, Commander? I'll let me speak to Captain Anderson then. Of course. We'll do that after the um. <laughs> um. What the fuck, man? Oh, it's gone up to level eight now. That's pretty cool. We're gonna speak to that. Add this in a minute, but we're gonna walk to Cora's den now. Do you know what? Actually, fuck it, let's just take a fast travel. Fuck that cheese. They told me it was you, but I didn't believe it. Shepard grew up and turned into a soldier. An impatient soldier. Who are you and why are you in my way? Name's Chris. You probably don't remember me, but we ran together in the 10th Street Ranch. Maybe you don't remember it yourself, running in a gang. None of the vids mention it when they're talking about you. The vids never tell the whole story. So, what can I do for the Reds? One of the Reds, Kurt Wiseman, got picked up by Turians. We'd like you to talk to the Turian guard in the bar and get Kurt out. I'll talk to the Turian and see what I can do. Thanks, Shepard. I knew you'd remember your old friends. The guard's over in Korra's den. Take care of this, and you'll never see me again. Yeah, of course I won't. Of course I won't. Definitely won't. What oh, bullets in your head, mate? How about that? Cunt. Business here, but not with you. Can I help you? You've got a prisoner named Kurt Wiseman. I'd like that prisoner freed. I'd like a lot of things, human. Desire forms the foundations of organized society. That said, the xenophobe will remain in Turian custody. This is not negotiable. <laughs> I'd rather not have to kill all your guards to free this man. Fucking hell. Why do you want this criminal released? Is it part of your mission, or are you just helping another human? I'm a spectre. Oh boy. I don't answer to you. Release Wiseman, now. The Council should have known the humans were not ready for the authority <laughs> of the spectre. <laughs> Fucking do it now, I'll put a bullet in your head. The prisoner will be released. Turian people at least respect the rule of law. Oh, Renegade! 
<laughs> uh, when next? Flux. Okay. Flux and over to Anderson. What the fuck? Flux. Oh, here we go. Played their games. Doran didn't have a clue what I was doing. He, he assumed I was cheating. But you were cheating, were you not? I was just tipping the scales in my favor, only as an experiment. It still sounds like cheating to me. To you, maybe. Uh. But this device is merely intended to simulate situations and record results. Recording losses is easy, of course. Nobody notices those. Why do you need to record these outcomes? Ah, now you're getting to the heart of it. I've spent the last five years developing a system that can accurately predict wins and losses on the Quasar. I just need a few more recorded wins and I can complete the algorithms. Can you do that? Isn't that illegal? It's illegal to use my system, but I won't use it. I'll sell it to others. I just need a few more wins recorded. I'll help you out. Ah. I suppose I could let you try it. There you go. When you've recorded enough wins, it'll let you know. Of course, if you get caught with the device, well, you saw what happened to me. Well, off you go. That data won't collect itself. Huh. Still can't believe that could happen. Oh, oh, okay. Hey there, welcome to Flex. I'm waiting for someone else. Don't often see someone getting as lucky as you.
So, did you record five wounds with the device yet? Here you go. I hope it's what you're looking for. Excellent indeed. This will provide me with invaluable data. Yeah. You enjoy those winnings. I'm gonna get the system completed. Yeah, <laughs> level up, both of them. Uh, we're gonna go for assault training thing. I get heavy armor already, so we'll go for uh go for pistols actually. Pistols and max max decryption. I don't know. Okay, so no. Speak to Captain Anderson. I might wrap stream. Up. I'm fucked. Today. Fuck. Missed out. Okay. Over to the uh, embassies, I think. I've um, just been smoking my peanuts up. Fuck, I chucked a grenade at her! Fuck! Oops. <laughs> oh dearie me! That's a bit overkill. Well, oh, nearly. What the? What are you doing there? I heard what happened under the Artemis Tau Cluster. The Council wasn't too happy about the destruction of those Prothean ruins. This isn't a game, Ambassador. Shepard's out there trying to stop Saren from destroying the galaxy. I know, I know. Just try to be a little more careful. The Council's watching you, and we all get judged on how you behave. Fucking hell. Alright. Miserable prick, where have you walked off to? Yes, Commander? Uh what do you know about Armiston Baines? Where did you hear that name? <laughs> Never mind, I don't want to know. Baines is dead. Has been for quite some time. So why are people talking like he's still alive? It's not common knowledge. Military is keeping it under wraps. Baines was doing some high-level work for the Alliance. Stuff even I wasn't aware of. One day he turns up dead on a drifting scout ship. Everyone suspects it was foul play, but it was never officially investigated. This is a cover-up, if I ever heard one. I don't know much about it. You should talk to Admiral Kohoku. One of his crews discovered Bane's body. I spoke to Kohoku. He never brought it up. You should mention Bane's the next time you see him. See if he'll tell you anything. Is there anything else, Commander? I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. <laughs> Let's go speak to the motherfucker. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. Never learns, does she? Honestly. Means you a lot more, um... A lot more, what's the word for it? Uh, animated than this guy. Just give me, give me a sec. All these guys, thank you very much for watching. Oh, no. Commander, any luck finding my recon group? Captain Anderson said you had information on Baines. Not as much as I'd like to. One of my crews found him, frozen stiff on board a derelict vessel. The missing recon group? 
The one I sent you to find? They were scouting the system we found Baines's ship in. You should have mentioned this earlier, Admiral. Baines is already dead. It's too late for him. I'm only concerned about my team. Someone has to find them. Please, Shepard. I'm counting on you. Got it. Oh, man. <laughs> Right, okay. Where you are then, let's go to the docking bay. In entertainment news, Francis Kitt has announced plans to direct... Oh, not fucking Elcor again. Cast members. The production will Jesus. open dramatic theater to the Elcor with a Hamlet who uses Elcor body language. Give that guy a moose. Kit claims that he's also excited by giving a human <coughs> audience the chance to do <coughs> Hamlet by his deeds and not his emotions. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Get back on this. In fact, I'll drop a quick save here and I'm gonna end the stream. Forgive me. Really rough tonight, so you have to bear with me, peeps. Right, okay. So who are we raiding tonight then, peeps? Who are we raiding? Who are we raiding? If it's available. Uh, just having a look on here. Is Finny back on? Oh, someone called Basic Bimbo's wearing a Pikachu outfit. <laughs> That's well cool. I go to? Oh, someone's playing Far Fox 10. We'll go to Luna Lizzie. Like I said, guys, forgive me for the lack of enthusiasm tonight. I feel really kind of bad for it. But thank you very much for watching. Hopefully, I get um, C3 Cooley, by the way. Thank you very much for watching. Superstar for that. I just noticed you there. Uh, we're going to drop a quick raid to Luna Lizzie, guys. And thank you very much for watching. I'll hopefully be much, much. Well, much better, feel much better tomorrow, guys. Thank you for your time tonight. Enjoy the YouTube video. All the best. Drop a like on the channel. Bye for now.